Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I bring to you guys my October favorites. So here I have laid out near me um, a wide range of like beauty related products that I have been loving for the entire month of October and honestly some part of September for some of these items. So if you guys want to see what I've been loving recently, then just keep watching. So my first favorite is actually a fashion favorite. Um, and I only have one of these, so that's why we're doing it first. Um, it is this pair of jeans from American Eagle. These are the mom jeans. I did talk about these in my American Eagle jeans haul, which I will link somewhere here for you guys to check out. I did actually try these on in that video, so if that's something that you're interested in watching, I definitely recommend to click that um, card that I have for you guys. Um, these honestly, I cannot stop wearing. I'm actually going to wear them later today. Um, they are so good. They're so good. Like the color, the cut, the length of the pants, the bagginess of the leg pants, the amount of distress, not too little, not too much. Like you guys, they're just so good. And I honestly just cannot get enough of these jeans. These are, I have several mom jeans from American Eagle, but these, these are my favorite. Okay, and I will continue to wear them for like literally the rest of the year because it's getting pretty cold here, but They're just so good. They're so good. They do my body right and that's what's most important. Okay So next we have hair care um, The first thing that I want to tell you guys about is this IGK first class charcoal detox dry shampoo Honestly, everything is like such a mouthful like all these products have like a 25 letter name, but whatever um, this is I believe their deepest, deepest, strongest level of their dry shampoos. I think they have three of them. This is the Deep Cleanse Level Detoxifying Oil Erasing Scalp Soothing Shampooing. No, that's a different part. That's in fridge. <laughs> um, dry shampoo. It is so good. This is a little bit on the pricier side. I do pick, get mine usually at um, Sephora, but they do sell this at Ulta. I think it retails for like $27. Everything is always linked down below, including prices, um, for you guys. But yeah, it is a little bit pricier, but honestly, I find that when I purchase things like Batiste, or that's really the only one that I know that I use, like, that's like drugstore, if you will, it's actually not that cheap. You know, it's like $13, and... I run through that shit like crazy and this will last me a month and a half to like two months depending on um, how often I'll be washing my hair. So, mm, and plus Batiste, I don't know, has this like underlying like air freshener kind of smell and this one smells like, I don't know, professional hair care. Like it just smells like a hair salon it smells to me. It smells really, really good um, and it works really, really well. So this one literally sucks up all of the oils in my scalp. Um, and honestly, it, for me, it kind of lasts like a day and a half. That doesn't really make a lot of sense. But like, for example, if I use it the one day, you know, let's say day two, um, I will use it and then day three, I'll wake up and my hair's less oily. Um, and sometimes I find that with other dry shampoos, it doesn't matter if I used it day two and day three. Like, day four, if I'm that daring, I'll wake up with oily as fuck hair. Like, you know, so this one, I feel like, not only dries out the oils, but it also kind of, like, stops or puts a hold on more oil production. Like, it just, my hair just doesn't look that greasy the rest of the days. However, I do find that with this one, I do get a lot of, a lot more buildup. So, it is a very, very, like, intense dry shampoo, so be wary of that, um... Make sure to be scrubbing your scalp really, really well when you shower. Um, and also, it isn't invisible. So when you apply it, it does turn your hair white. So you always have to be, you know, weary that you're brushing all of that stuff out and you don't walk out looking like a crazy person. Um, but it works. It works miracles, you guys. This is, I think, my second, if not my third bottle of this specific dry shampoo. And it works really, really well. So the next hair care product is this Matrix Total Results Length Goals Extension Perfector. This is part of the Matrix Times Bellamy collection. I think they did shampoo, conditioner, and then like this. I'm not really sure. This was the only product that actually caught my eye because it kind of sounds like it 
it was targeted towards people like me who are like, oh, let me extend the lifespan of my hair extensions, you know. Um, but it basically claims to detangle, revive shine, and provide heat protection for up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. So I just kind of thought it would be like a serum for your hair extensions. And I was like, whatever. Um, it retails for, I think, anywhere from like $18 to $20. And I got mine at Ulta. You can get it wherever they sell Matrix products. Um, you guys, this is amazing. Like this as a detangler. You know, I don't really notice shine. I use other things that like provide shine. You know, I use other serums, other sprays. Um, in co combination with this that provides shine so that I don't really like care about that part um, And then the heat protection. I mean you should always be using heat protectant I don't use I just use this and then like the it's a 10 so they both do the exact same thing in terms of like providing heat protection I am pretty sure that it's a 10 also provides heat protection So that's not really what caught my eye, but the detangler you guys this is amazing for detangling hair I use this on my natural hair and my hair extensions because I'm an avid hair extension user um, And it literally detangles them in seconds um, I do experience a lot of like matting and tangles um, in my like natural hair and in my hair extensions especially like in the nape of my neck um, when I wear hair extensions, like it'll just tangle the shit out of my hair and my hair extensions So products like these are like a must for my hair care Like I need something that will gently brush out my hair maintain the like um, What is it called the elasticity maintain the strength the integrity of my hair of all my hair You know when I purchased the one on my head um, So I love products like these and this one like there's the detangling part of this is so Good and this one smells really good. It smells it's very sweet So if you're not a sweet scent kind of girl, you probably won't like this um, But it smells very like vanilla y like candy y kind of scent. Um, it's just really good I'm sure you can find a detangler on the market that is more like friendly budget affordable budget friendly What the <laughs> budget friendly and affordable, but you guys this works really really well So I will honestly continue to purchase this because I'm not gonna stop wearing hair extensions um, and it were, it's like the best of both worlds. I use it for my real hair and for my hair extensions. So it's just really, really good. It's one of the best detanglers that I've tried. Um, so yeah, definitely recommend. So that was it for hair care. And now we'll move on to, I guess this is essentially skincare. Um, this is the It Cosmetics Confidence in a Cream Anti-Aging Armor Rejuvenating Concentrate. You guys, look at how empty this is. It probably has like one more use in there. I'm gonna go pick up another one um, from the Sephora VIB sale so I can get safe and coin. Um, but you guys, this is amazing. Like it's so nourishing. Like on days that I, sometimes I get like a little, a little cheap and I'm like, you know what? I'm not doing anything today. Let me just use like a regular, you know, drugstore moisturizer. My skin instantly looks different like if I go one day two days without using this my skin looks so dull it looks so dry like I literally cannot live without this stuff this is hands down my favorite moisturizer for probably a good time I used to use the Peter Thomas Roth one but then I decided to switch it up after I seen one of my favorite like influencers use this one and I was like all right okay girl you got me you got me hooked so she definitely did because this is amazing i think it's like 39 dollars, so it is a little bit pricey but it's not like the most expensive like um uh, moisturizer that i've had the peter thomas roth one i think is like 59 so that one's definitely more expensive but this one i just really like better than the peter thomas roth one it's so good if you haven't tried it you definitely should um it is more of like a thicker creamy like a more whipped but not as light like it's a thick whipped creamy consistency um but it honestly just leaves your face feeling moisturized like it doesn't feel like heavy on my skin it just feels like a good cream so the next thing this is just kind of like miscellaneous beauty but i wanted to throw it in here because you guys i cannot get enough so the this is what i'm talking about is the lights lacquer nail polishes so i this is not even everything i have i probably have like close to 10 right now um, these nail polishes are so good. This is the brand by Kathleen Lights um, here on YouTube and they're just so amazing. I currently have on my nails this like paper off-white kind of like an olive undertone called Yours Truly. These three are from her new like romance collection I think. 
Um, so it's this one. I just picked up my favorite, like before film in this video. Um, A Temporary Madness and At Last. Yeah, Romance. Um, so these these have been like my diet ride or die favorites this blue one so pretty and this yellow one also so pretty today i wanted to do kind of like a more oh i got makeup on my nail a more like classic sleek um nail so i went with the white one white it's like an off-white yours truly um but another favorite from like previous collections probably like when she first started it is girl power this is a beautiful like Honestly, it reminds me of like Sailor Moon, not Sailor Moon, but more like Sailor Venus um, kind of nail polish. It's just so pretty, like such a pretty shimmery, iridescent, duochrome kind of um, nail polish. Really, really pretty. And I think they retail for $12. I don't know. Um, but if you sign up for like coupons, she's always sending out coupon codes. If you sign up for text messages, you can get, you know, like 10% off your first order. Um, she has bundles, a lot going on. But they're just so good and they're really quick drying which i love they are so amazing and there's just there's such a such an amazing color selection like so good these have been my favorite i honestly stopped getting acrylics just because a lot they were closed where i live for a really long time and i was like there's no point in going and getting your nails done and then not having to fill like you're just wasting your money so i just started picking up nail polishes and now i just can't stop painting my own nails so and saving money you know so that was it for like miscellaneous beauty now we are moving on to makeup um these are not new products these are not like new revolutionary products no these are just things that i tried in the month of october that and like some of september that i cannot stop using so the first thing is this lunar beauty moon prism blush palette you guys, this is so amazing. I literally have not used another blush since I bought this. Like, they are so pretty. It honestly doesn't even really look like I have hit a dent on anything. Um, the only one that I don't find myself using that often is this one, Gravity. But I have used it, like, once or twice. Still very beautiful. But, like, my go-to favorites is this one, Stargaze. Which I'm wearing today, actually. And Spacey. Oh, my God. This one. This, like, mauve one. When I'm doing kind of, like, a more tan, deep look this one divine okay this one um soleil is also very very pretty but it's like a shimmer based blush so if that's not your cup of tea then you're probably not gonna like it but even this one it's a very cute like bubble gum pink like they're just so freaking good all of them so amazing um this product does tend to be sold out a lot of the time so i definitely recommend like signing up for their email notifications um but i do think that they carry this at sephora as well they should so just just look for it okay girl you are not gonna be disappointed it's just really that good i think this was like 45 or 49 dollars but definitely worth it because you get like six blushes in one that good next for makeup is this this is this is these eyelashes these are the araceli beauty um lashes in the style cabo these are foam mink um i don't really remember the price point but i know it's from like 10 to 14 dollars and these have quickly become my favorite. I did show these in my um, full face of Latino owned makeup brands. And you guys, I just can't stop wearing them. They're so beautiful. They're like the appropriate length, but still super wispy. So it still makes your looks kind of just like flirty. I don't know, really adorable. I love these. The next beauty product is this eyeliner so this is also from araceli beauty it is their ojos perfectos liquid liner in night or noche basically just black this it's funny because i mentioned this obviously in my latino owned full face makeup video um i mentioned this and i mentioned that i really liked it but i had recently purchased my one size beauty liquid liner you know However, I find myself reaching this literally 9 out of 10 times. Like, I just go for this one all the time. So it's quickly taken priority over the One Size Beauty one. Um, I do think that this is literally the exact same price point as that one. It's $19. Uh, but I love this so much that you guys... I went out and I bought it in brown as well. Um, I wanted... I love brown liner with, like, shadow, pencil, 
and liquid liner. So I wanted something a little bit more, still really, really good quality, but a little bit more natural for like fall time or just on those days where you're just not trying to go all out and have something like super harsh like black. I picked up the brown one. Um, I think it was, I don't remember when I picked it up, but they were having a sale. So I like got it for like $17 instead of like 19. Um, but you guys, these are just really freaking good. And this one is the exact same name. It's the Ojos Perfectos liquid liner in coffee or cafe. You guys, really good. Um, very comparable to the um, Patrick Star brand one. Not the darkest eyeliners on the market, but still really, really good quality. So next I have complexion items and that's it for the video. Um, the first thing that I want to talk about is this Beauty Blender Opal Essence Serum Primer. So this primer is very good. Um, it does have a lot of shimmer in it, but that's never like transparent over the makeup, if that makes sense. But I wanted to talk about this in combination with a specific foundation. So this with my NARS, um, what is this called? Radiant Longwear Foundation, these ones, is like the perfect, luminous, dewy, healthy, juicy skin combo. Like it's so freaking good. These have quickly become like this month this past month's favorites just th this combo so good um i have this foundation in two different shades one is barcelona and the other one is fiji this has been like my winter shade for the longest time and then this was like my summer shade like a year and a half ago i don't know a long time ago because this does not match me but because i was like a little bit more tan over the summer um i would use like one drop of this all over the face and then like two drops of this so in combination together make a pretty good combo but these these together are amazing so out of nowhere i tried this with other foundations and it was like eh. and then i tried this and i pulled this these guys out of like retirement and together i have fallen in love with this combo mm, so good this is just really really good it provides the best amount of like radiance which obviously is in combo with this specific foundation because it's a radiant longwear foundation perfect amount of like radiance health juiciness dewiness so good i i recommend this combo you guys or probably really just like any radiant kind of foundation would do the trick Okay guys, so that basically rounds up today's video. If you guys are interested in any of these products, make sure to check the description box. You already know. If you liked mainly the beauty products, if you liked any of these beauty products, check out Sephora's sale. Save your coin, you guys. Um, a lot of these items I purchased originally from Sephora, and so they should be applicable. Or the, the VIB sale should be applicable on these items. Um, with that being said, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Your presence, your support means the world to me. Please don't forget to leave your future video requests in the comment section down below. You know the drill with that. And don't forget to believe in yourselves. Stay woke, stay educated, and stay safe. And I'll see you guys in next week's video. Bye!